time to wake up. Man. Let's go for a walk. Hi, praise God, praise Jesus. Let's go for a walk. Don't need anything in there. Let's go for a walk in the woods on a road. Man. Man. That was loud. Yeah. This is awesome. Hi. Hey. There may be somebody in that heaven or not. Let's go for a walk, or jog, or run, or all of the above. Who says that? God's everywhere. God knows. But that means the heavens, heaven, all of the above. All of the above. All of the above. That's a pretty good way to say things. That's a pretty good way to say things. All of the above. It's like the heavens in heaven and where God lives. He can see everything, but he likes heaven better, I think. Hello? Hello. This is a 360 video. This is a 360 video. Something in my shoe. Hey, 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 lesbian, guys, lesbian, I tried to look cool when I put my shoe on to feel more athletic, so I would, I don't know, not get hurt, feel better, feel healthier, something like that, which is not the way that other people did that, I don't understand, I don't understand, hey, that looks beautiful, check that out. Look at that, that way. That's awesome. Look how beautiful that looks. I think it's the sun shining on that house. 
Grab, no. 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 I don't know. It looks dark in that house. It's shining on something else. The yard? Maybe that guy's house. Maybe it's shining on that guy's house. That guy's house. That person's house. Where's the sun shining? It looks godly. I can feel it because I know God. It's really good. It's really good. That sun is shining. Where is it shining? You know, I'm actually trying to, you know, I'm not crazy. When you know God, you know God. You know about the Bible. You study the Bible. You, you have faith. You know who God and Jesus are. So you don't get it wrong. You don't randomly start following the sun. You're not crazy because you have God and Jesus and God has you. And it makes sense for a godly reason. When you have faith and you know God, you know in your heart that it's from, you know in your heart that it's from God. Where's this? Hello? Hello? It's beautiful here. Whoa, it's scary. Wrong way. I didn't know where this went. I was going to go to my neighbor's house, but it's scary as crap to go that way. Huge yeah. trees knocked down. He's got a big dog. It's like a he's like a wolf, <clears throat> but he's a dog. Thank God he's a dog. <laughs> Thank God he's a dog. Thank God they're dogs. Better than a wolf. A wolf would be scary as crap. Wolf is mean as shit. Wolf. They're worse than, they are pretty bad in the Bible. Wolves. God, God doesn't like wolves. But some of them, you know, they're created by God. Wolves are created by God, but um, they're pretty bad. <laughs> A pack of wolves. A pack of wolves. It's in the Bible, they're not that good. <sighs> Dogs can be okay. You gotta really study about dogs to know how they are. Study the Bible, because you might know them better. You you probably know them way better than I do. If you, I don't know. But the Bible says talks about the Bible doesn't say anything. God says and uses the Bible to tell us the truth about everything. And God talks about dogs in the Bible. <clears throat> I encourage you to read about how God looks at dogs. And everything in the Bible, and wolf, and how God looks at wolves. <clears throat> I barely made it out of there. <clears throat> I have the right of way. I have the right of way. Feels like some animal took a crap. Smells like some animal took a crap. I don't know who. An animal, not a human. Unless, I don't know, some human could. Yeah. Some human or, you know, I heard flies around it. So. Could have been a bear's crap. You gotta be nice to animals. You gotta be nice to them. Hey. 
a walk in the woods. <clears throat> a literal walk in the woods. Who do you think I am? A false idol? <clears throat> what else would I call this video? Maybe something different. Maybe you're right. God knows. Hi. Hey. This sucks. Hello. Uh. Hello. This is the original home that was here, I think, but I don't know when it was built, maybe 1900, I don't know. I have to look at it closer and you just look up on the computer when it was built. <sighs> or you can look at the foundation and kind of know like or look at the building materials. They used to make the two by fours a different size and kind of tell by like, I don't know. But this house was here when they, when they first got to the neighborhood. Look how beautiful it is. Tim, hello Tim, hello Tim. Mishka. Mishka. Hello. Hi. Wow. Beautiful here. <clears throat> it's beautiful here. Beautiful here. Beautiful. It's peaceful. Really like it here. I really like it. It's a special place. It's a really special place. <laughs> I wonder if Tim wants to sell it. This is the Solanovich place. really beautiful there's a pond it's really beautiful here right now I was gonna see if Tim's home or whoever was here if Mishka was here if Mishka was staying at the guest house if he still lets him stay there oh I'm not going there <laughs> Tim Tim's pretty nice I better go. I was going to say hi to them. <clears throat> they show up at my house sometimes. You know, knocking the door like the old days. That's okay. That's how it was here and is. The uh, neighbors. I better get out of here. 
that's Tim's house, but maybe one day when he gets really old, when he's 78, he may want to retire to a regular place once he's retired and he gets social security and stuff like that. He may say hey, he doesn't want to do all that hard work anymore, like working tractors or whatever. So it's only God knows. This is one of my favorite houses ever. I think it's my second favorite or favorite. Probably my second favorite or favorite. It's beautiful. It's really sunny there at that house in the lawn. It's probably my second or third favorite house. I like my mom and dad's house. I like my house the best. Mine's the art school. I like it the best. It's pretty good. I really like that house. It's pretty good. Maybe one day I'll get to live there. Who knows? God knows. I'd be kind to everybody. Try to keep it how it how it was when when the Solonovich people were there in Mishka. I like living far away from people. That's why I like the art school. It was pretty far away from bed. There's two guys that live near my house. So I don't, I don't, they're not that near my house, but I know I'm used to how they are and stuff. I'm used to how they are. I was like a little further away from society. Maybe it's really beautiful here. It is. I can feel the love from God, how warm the sun was. It felt loved, but I don't know what animal used the bathroom there. We I don't want one of them to jump out and try to. I don't know. Hey, somebody, it's crazy. I can't smell it anymore. Before I could smell, somebody took a crap. This is pretty far away from society, but it's like right around other people and it's close to town. There's, can't really get too far away from the earthly sin of others on this earth. I tried to go to California, it was there too. It's pretty good. I like it here in this neighborhood better than any other house on earth. <sighs> like my third favorite house is or my second or third favorite house is my mom and dad's house. That one's pretty good because I'm used to like the neighbors there. I know <laughs> they lived there since the 90s. And there's another house that probably a bunch of houses in Roanoke that are okay. But only four of them maybe. That would be okay. I wouldn't even want to live in that fourth one. But, um, I'm a wealthy American. I'm a wealthy American. <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> hey. 
I don't know how, but God knows. I don't even want to talk about it. Why I work harder, but I have to. That's the thing is they make you feel like it's not enough. The demons and the devil. When you have Jesus, it's plenty. I'm a godly, kind, good person. This is a mean son. Try to attack you when they share you that one. You can feel it in my heart. When you have God and Jesus, you can your faith is better than if you don't have God and Jesus, obviously. But uh when when you read the Bible, your faith is better than when usually when you don't but some agnostics may live their life in a righteous way. This is scary. I don't know what's like so dark and selfish here. Is it because I'm going back to my selfish house? So much work. It's more work. <laughs> to even say you have kind of enough of money. That's why it's like you never really know <laughs> how much God's work you're really doing. <laughs> Heads, dark and cold there today. Or <laughs> I mean, it's just, God made me say that. I didn't know why. It's not the entire day, but oh, I don't know. God makes us say things different from how we planned. Sometimes, most of the time, for some. Most, some people just trust God with everything. You know, like he carries them along through their whole life. Like there's never a problem. How amazing. Has it, God hasn't had to do that for me. Or has, I haven't gotten to feel that way. But he does that for us when we can't go on. I think that's what I've had to experience. It was scary. The way that I experienced it, but I don't, so other people may not have. Other people are. I don't know. Uh, how's that guy? Other people. Wonder where the godly sun was shining. I wonder where the godly sun was shining. Was it shining on my house, or is it, did the sun change since then? I thought it was shining on the neighbor down there's house. Yeah. Smelled the dog's poo. He's probably not even home. It may have been shining on me. Well, I don't want to walk up there too, too hard after eating food. I don't want to wear out my muscles. Looks like it's shining on that side of my house. But I don't know where it would have been shining before. <sighs> Looks like that's where I was out there on the porch uh, balcony. It's not a porch, a uh, porch, yep. The porch. Look the other way. Looks like there's some sun shining on him. 
or don't look for a sign. The Bible says don't look for a sign ever. But it looks like there's some sun shining on that guy's house. Hey God, let's, let's see if this is even godly or not. You can feel it with your heart. Yeah, it looks, looks beautiful and godly. Yeah. If I went towards that, you know how those people feel when they go for a big walk. Those hikers, you're young. I don't get to usually don't get to feel that way. This was a walk. This was a walk, not even really a hike. It sucked. Not this thing. This thing didn't suck, dude. It's it sucked not getting to um feel the way that I did when I was much younger, but this was way more beautiful. This was a simple walk. This was a simple walk. Um less than one mile walk. I think and it didn't suck at all but I think I know what you're trying to say you're trying to make my words mean the opposite of what they do oh Bob is he okay oh Bob look at <laughs> look at this statue of Al Bob <sighs> he puts his his walking stick down in power. I hope he doesn't fall down and die at any moment if I got it wrong. How oh, Bob. He's good. Like a little dog. Bowing to him. In praise. <laughs> I don't know. Looks like you made it this far. Poor John Ozu. The Italians would say, What are you doing up there? Showing a cool camera angle. Let's go inside.